So there's this movie that's in pre-production. It's called Alina of Cuba. Oh. Alina of Cuba? Like, Alina oh. is the daughter of Fidel Castro. Oh. Right. How do you spell that? That's my sister's name. A-L-I-N-A. -A. Oh yeah, that's exactly like my sister's name. <laughs> that was my guess. <laughs> do two one two spelling. What's oh. another way to do it? Like with the E? Uh, e I don't know if it's his pronouncing it. Alina, Elena, Elena. Oh, U-H? Alina. Alina. Salina? S -E Alina Castro. Alina yeah. Castro. So it's Castro's daughter. Yeah. She's the communist like, queen of Cuba. Mm -hmm. That's a fire title. Communist queen. So it's it's really that's what the is movie it? is about. The queen of Cuban sandwiches. But um Love Cuban sandwiches. Cuban. Even though John Legg was almost not associated with his film at all, he's pretty pissed about the casting. Really? Mm hmm Why? Because they didn't cast him? No, because they cast somebody else as uh Fidel Castro who's not Cuban? even Latino. What? Oh. Pedro Pascal? Keep it. it, it oh. Oscar Isaac. Denzel Washington. <laughs> Samuel Jackson. That would probably be better. That would be a great cast. He's, he's a famous guy? Yeah. Who's Pedro Who Pascal? Is that like the uh, Mandalorian guy? Oh. Can you imagine? Yeah. Denzel Narcos, Fidel? Yeah. Narcos, yeah. Denzel Fidel. He's like, okay, all right, okay, okay, all right. Okay, all right, okay. okay. Let, let me guess. Okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, what about the dude from uh, uh, um, the new. Uh, Star Wars thing and um. Did someone say Oscar Isaac or? Andor. Yeah, he did. Andor, yeah. Whatever his name is. Yeah, what's his name? Oh, fuck, no. fuck. It's not that guy. Who was also in Narcos Mexico, wasn't he? I don't remember. So he's not I think Latin. So. Is it Shia LaBeouf? Oh, that would be, oh, that'd that'd be, would be a bad, a bad Who actually <laughs> looks like Castro though? You don't think this guy looks like Castro? He kind of does actually. What the? He does actually though. <laughs> he does. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. What the fuck? Wait a minute. Holy he does. shit. Especially it's if the you see eyes. The yeah. 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 That's he looks like the younger Castro. You have to admit, he kind of looks oh like a. He does. Here. No, because first of all, my brain recognized James Franco. And yeah. then I looked, I'm like. Oh, James Franco. <laughs> James Castro? He should be voiced by John Lennon. Well, what about, what about, uh... That's not even in makeup to look like Castro. Wow. That's just like, that's just how he looks. Wait, we got Luigi fucking hating on this guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But what about, uh... <laughs> He was a good Luigi, man, come on. Hey, he was an okay Luigi. But he wasn't Italian, right? John Leguizamo? Nah. That's not an Italian name. That's true, he could pass. Is he Cuban? I think Ooh. he's... Puerto Rican? Something like that. Rama? I thought he was just Mexican, my bad. I think he's Puerto Rican. He had no right to play an Italian plumber is what I'm saying. Cause he's from New York or some shit. Cause remember on To Wong Fu, he's like, I got more legs than a bucket of chicken. And then he was like, I'm a Boricua. Or something like yeah. that. He's probably Puerto Rican. Yeah. Yeah, maybe, yeah. So by the way, I love John Leguizamo. So John Leguizamo is like a huge a pest. advocate for like, you know, Latino representation in Hollywood. And so he's speaking up about this. He's pretty pissed <laughs> that uh, this what he said something like, how is this still happening? That's his like- Wait, I'm confused because maybe I don't know too much about like the Latin X world, but the way I view, yeah. the way I view- <laughs> They don't like that there, shit. There's a little <laughs> window. But, okay, but like the way I view South America, right? Mm -hmm. It's just like, I feel like it's still European, but with mixed indigenous. Okay. Because there's black, Latin. There's yeah. white, Latin. white Latin. There's yeah. like, yeah, because like there are French people, yeah. Spanish people. There's Asian Latin too. Yeah, and then Asian. I just feel like it's a Spanish speaking American country, right? So like, I don't understand. Technically, it's a South American country. But shouldn't he, if he's going to be uh, Fidel, shouldn't he be a Cuban? Uh, I guess is what. Yeah, but like Fidel, about. I don't even know if he's Cuban. Well, because so this so, this, those, so the history is so the history is they're. Me uh, Central or Mexican American, and they went to Cuba to liberate Cuba, but they're all Latino. So some of these guys weren't born in Cuba. Like he might be, I think Colombian or whatever, but him and Che Guevara went to Cuba to liberate it. Mm. I don't think, I think his gripe is that he's, Franco's not even Latino at all. Do, do you think he's got a gripe oh. that like Ana de Armas is playing Marilyn Monroe? I do. Yeah, Steve does. What do you think of that shit? Steve Ouch. Hey, what do you, hey, what do you think of that shit? I do. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, though? It's like a little bit of a two-way street. Like, for example, I heard um, no, yeah, makes... Samuel, Samuel L. Jackson, I heard, uh, also got upset at, uh, what's his face, uh, the guy who does Nope and... Uh, um, uh, Jordan, Jordan Peele? Peele? Jordan Peele, because if you're going to cast uh, somebody for the African-American experience, but he casts somebody that's like uh, an British. actual oh. person from Africa, an oh. African, oh. Yeah. you know, uh, what's the uh, immigrant, African right. immigrant. Not yeah, it's same. also not doing the same thing. So I know okay. that like in those, you know, when we're talking about, it's funny because 
Well, you look at like Europeans, right? When we look at like white people, we don't we don't call them Europeans. We're yeah. gonna say they're Germans or there's something, that, right? But then you look at like Asians, and you don't like people don't go like you're Japanese or that. Everybody just is Asian. We don't go by continents. Yeah. So in the same concept, right? I understand that there's it's just a double-edged sword. But if we do a little bit, we, don't we just go Jackie can't make Chan's anybody Asian American. Happen. Jackie Chan's uh, Asian. I'm saying other people usually look at us and they yeah, just call us yeah. Asian. You guys right. ask right. each other what right. you are. You know what I mean? Like it, that that happens, Nikki, all the fucking time. What do you mean, yeah. you guys, bro? You, I mean, you people. You, you tiny eye fucks. His eyes got so big. <laughs> when I saw Anna de Armas play Marilyn Monroe, I was like, mm -hmm. interesting. Right. But if, I but mean, you know, if the guy that looks like Fidel Castro is going to play Fidel he Castro. He looks fucking like Fidel Castro, well, I think, dude. I think what makes it different is that, they're, like, Marilyn Monroe's always been played by someone white. So then it's like, oh, at least let's just get one where it's not, maybe? Yeah, yeah but already, did, Who's Anna de Armas? She's white or not white? She no, brown. She's not. She brown girl. Let me push back a little bit. So you guys watched Pam and Tommy, right? Yes, I did. There's the a somewhere. Yeah, there, the somewhere there's a there's a busty blonde actress who can't get a fucking job in Hollywood because they took this chick and they put prosthetics all over her body. She's oh, a brunette. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's a yeah, brunette. Yeah, yeah. She's not like she doesn't have fucking double D's. She's she's not like Pam Anderson looking. So they took her and they actually made her look more like Pam Anderson using prosthetics. And they could have just used yeah. the blonde. There's some busty blonde actress out there who's fucking eating at Denny's tonight yeah. because she can't get a fucking job in Hollywood yeah. because this chick fucking took her and work. And she's skipping out on the bill because it's too expensive these days. She's, she's yeah. walking out and she's fucking she's, dying in the ditches. She's you know stealing moons over my hammy. He goes, this is just what's called acting. You know what I mean? You know, like this is just acting. Like you're James Franco, you're gonna act and be a Cuban okay. man. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's another thing too. That's, is like Fidel and seen eating a Cuban sandwich. Like Fidel would. <laughs> like what's the alternative that people want? A perfectly cast film that yes. ends up sucking ass and they won't even see it. They anymore. honestly would be way happier with yeah. that. Hey, idea. yeah, exactly. Did you guys see Morbius? Nope. <laughs> perfectly that's cast. A perfectly movie, cast movie. <laughs> yeah. Um. So Jared Leto, he pretended to be in a wheelchair. Like the whole fucking time, right? But then even between takes, he would make everyone wait like 45 minutes for him to do bathroom breaks because he wanted to like take his wheelchair to the bathroom. Oh Dude, it's Morbius, dog. And yeah. then that movie ended up like sucking complete dick. Yeah. Because yeah. he spent too much time to go into the bathroom. Yeah, and everyone thinks that movie completely sucks. Yeah, just terrible. Yeah. Right. Be because he went too method on it. But that's the thing, it's like, you know, they, these people are still doing a business, they're still making a movie that has yeah. to sell. They need a star. I'm also confused product, about yeah. like, the idea the of what is white, cause then like, so like, alright, Cameron Diaz, to me she looks like a white girl, but she's not, right? She's la Latino. Is she? So I think for Latin, she white as for fuck Latin to me. people, <laughs> I forgot what the term was, I think it's actually like mestizo or something. But the actual Latin like group that they identify with, or what they're who they're fighting for, are partial Spanish blood, partial indigenous. Blood. But Castro yeah. looks like a Spanish man. Yeah. Well, here's what Leguizamo <laughs> actually. He looks like a European. But he, can, but he can have he dude. Part. Oh, you know what? So that yeah. that 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 mestizo whatever like is what they're going after. What is it? John Leguizamo is a hypocrite, dog. Why? He what? played too long. Food? He played a Chinese man in the movie Pest. He played a fucking Chinese. Delivery man, and he did a very strong accent like this, Dude, and his name was Ping, I think, I think and it's one of my favorite saying. movies. <laughs> I love that movie. The Pest. The Pest. Yeah, it's. it's, it's and he played in Italian, which he has no fucking right. Is. So who are you, John? That's, that's what I think he's saying when he says, "How is Hollywood like? How is it still going on?" Yeah. It's like he knows that he was a part of something that should be expired by now. Does he? I, I think so, because he doesn't do that anymore. Okay. You know, like, that was all the 90s shit that everybody He said from Ice Age, you know? So, but, would he yeah. be happier if it was fucking, like, George Lopez, who looks nothing like him? <laughs> Honestly, yes, he would, like, probably. probably. He looks yeah. nothing like Fidel Castro, but he is Latino, or, fuck it. That'd be a good take. Like, that's why I wish we could just go into alternate like timelines just to see what people would what say you, what? because I feel like some people will hate no matter who you put in that spot. 100%. You can't make They're just gonna go, happen. oh, you could have found a better guy. Oh, you could have found this. But guy. remember you when know? um Scott Johansson was gonna be he, this like trans person in this? In this she was also gonna be Asian too. Oh, well, Ghost in the Shell, Asian. right? Ghost in the Shell, she was Asian, yeah, yeah, yeah. but yeah. Scott Johansson can. Scott Johansson, the way that they the way that they <laughs> find budgets for these movies is they attach dollars to a name, yeah. and then they know they can sell it in this market, right? So like that's big, that right? makes or breaks the movie. Makes or breaks the movie. Mm -hmm. So they were going to take a story about this trans person, and then but then because Scott Johansson is a straight woman, they're like uh, like the, everyone came out backlash, backlash, and then they canceled it. And she's like, yeah, fine, fuck it, I won't no pay this, movie. I won't pay yeah. this person. No Sorry. movie now, it doesn't yeah. exist. You don't even get this trans story being they, told. They, they, there's no earmarked dollars towards 
towards some rando who yeah, yeah. is that person. It's just that you now have nuked that story out of existence. So that story doesn't get told now. Yeah. yeah. So that's There's what, um, but then with yeah. this one, because please, it's, please, uh, because this is like a Cuban historical figure, you know, that's what he's pissed about. He said, how is Hollywood excluding us, but stealing our narratives as well? You know, um, that's the difference. So I like The Last Samurai, right? And I was just like, but here we go again with the last of the fucking Mohicans, whitewashing a <laughs> fake ass story, right? Yeah. And then I researched it and there's actually three white samurais. <laughs> yeah. There's there's a British guy, he he got knighted, um, he became a samurai, mm -hmm. and they just, they, and there's a French guy that went to Japan to teach them oh, how yeah. to uh, like, shoot. And well, then, and then they, 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 and then they, they ended up being, um, they ended up being um, 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 like accepted by Japanese, and then they became samurai, all this shit, they were knighted. Mm -hmm. So I was like, oh fuck, so that's an interesting story. And then he just blended all of those stories but into one. was his name Arugren? Arugren san. <laughs> Captain Arugren. Arugren san. No, no, no Katana, please. <laughs> so I, after that, I was like, oh fuck, that, that's kind of cool. I, I can't get mad at it anymore, you know? Because I thought yeah. what they did was some fucking dances with bull, wolves bullshit on us. Also, it's also not like there's no samurai movies with all Asians. Like there's a fucking million of them. Do you guys remember Make one with a white guy? That's like that bad? Like not really. Yeah. Do you guys remember Scary Movie? When I love uh, scary. yeah, love Scary Movie, right? We all love Scary Movie. There's a part where I you were end there. no, no. There's a, <laughs> there's a part where what's her name sees like Chris Pratt's ex-wife. Uh, oh yeah, she sees the fucking. She sees this little ghost, and he's like, this all right, little the Japanese boy. the Juan grudge ghost. And yeah. then yeah, the joke yeah. is that they're like, like this is like this is a white lady, and so she doesn't know. Like this is probably how how Asian people talk, and so she's like she's like Hiroshima, Nagasaki, yeah. Samurai, Toyota, Honda. And he's saying the same shit back to her, <laughs> like using just all tropey fucking yeah, yeah, yeah. all Japanese brand all, names. Yeah. <laughs> like Mitsubishi, Nintendo. Nagasaki, yeah, Nintendo. Right, and right. that's the joke. The joke is ignorance. Yeah. The joke, the joke yeah. is yeah. ignorance. It's playing so on an existing ignorance. Yeah. yeah. But then now people will go like, "That's fucked up." Like, Dude, that uh, that shit still holds. You're up. talking about billionaire. Asians right now, <laughs> billionaire Asian companies, how dare you? <laughs>